Hello and welcome, Raleen. Here with the new Plastic Plastic Duck Simulator DLC. Hippo Space is finally here. Let's freaking go with all the ducks, of course. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, Albert the Alien's our first duck. Oh, <laughs> already? I am shocked. <laughs> look at the little robot thing. Oh my god, look at this place. Listen to it. Oh. It is so strange to start off and we don't have Nugget. Look at this. I think I'm gonna turn off names while we play. Just while we see the new pool. Alright, let's let's try E. Let's see where we can sit here. Oh, all on top of the structure. With a little shallow pool. Where's Albert? Oh! What? <laughs> well, there's Nugget. Oh, no, no, no! Oh, we're in a dome. Which I guess is pretty obvious in uh, the image of the pool. Look at this pool. Holy crap. Can we shoot infinite nuggets? Can I do another one? Okay, no. What's this? Username? Really? Invalid user. Oh. Got more secrets. Uh, I have no idea what that's supposed to be yet. Can we click on any of these? No, just the button. Interesting. Alright, where else can we sit? Oh, it's like a little lounge area. Look at the sky. Oh, it's gorgeous. We got Narwhal. Excellent. Will we get a big floaty hippopotamus is the real question. You like extra shiny? Listen to this music. Oh, oh, oh. See that out there? Is that bringing us a new duck? What is that? Is it gonna come in here? Oh, what's this? New duck! Oh, <laughs> excellent. Welcome to the pool, Bobblehead. Oh, and he's already topped over. Aww. Will you take me through it? I wanna go through that. Come on, Bobblehead. Looks like it comes out over here. Right, this might be where we're going. Where are the other two ducks? Okay, they're just floating along. Oh! Oh! Oh, this is fun! Yeah, go in there! Go in there! Is there zero gravity in that in that big bubble? Oh, where does that go? Oh, come on, Nugget! Oh, it's squirting out water! Look at this! Oh, this is fun! I cannot wait to have a full pool in here! We are definitely going to be leaving this going for a couple days. This is like my next two days planned. <laughs> All of my free time is going into this pool. Oh, no, I want you to go to the other tube. That's fine. Let's... Ah. Exciting. <sighs> oh, yes! Oh, yay, Marlene Jean. Always good having you in the pool, young man. Will you do me proud? Will you go through the lazy river with all the lights? Go through the tunnel. Come on. Let's go. This is a cool pool. I like it. So it looks like that weird UFO thing just circles it. I don't think it's going to do anything. Oh, I guess Benny can't escape. He's actually stuck in here. Music is interesting. I'm into it. It's good. I like it. Yeah. Right, let's sit up here for a second and look around. What is this? Wait, what? What is this? It's connected to the outside over here. I really want to see in there. And I definitely want to see what the frick this is. Looks like we can shoot ducks out of it though. I'm also surprised that there's no hippo floaty. I was expecting a hippo floaty for sure. I'm thinking there's a duck in that thing that'll eventually join us. Oh! Oh! Did he just go through the tunnel and I missed it? Is that what I just heard? 
Damn it. He went at full speed, too. What happens in there? Damn it. <laughs> Alright. Beelzebub. I want you not in that tube. Go over there. Get in that tube, okay, buddy? Yeah, keep going. Keep going. No, 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 you're going the wrong way, bud. Oh, look who joined us. Oh! Oh, oh, oh! Here we go. Freaking oh, well done, Bobblehead. Oh. What is this? What is it, Zero G? Oh, it is! He's floating! Even with that big head, he's freaking weightless in space. <laughs> you are so brave, Bob. So brave. Oh man, look at him. Still top heavy. <laughs> Still being weighed down a little bit, even in zero G. What happens when he goes up? <laughs> look at him over there. Oh, that is so cute. Alright, who else joined us? Ooh, Dodo, our brinkled uh, donut duck. <gasps> Nugget, are you finally going through? Oh, there's so much I need to experience, but I really want to know what happens when he gets up in there. I guess we'll see. I am so looking forward to having a pool just absolutely full of ducks and this freaking thing is just full of them floating around. <laughs> uh, oh! Where are you going in such a hurry? Oh, oh! Albert's going through again! It goes into like a third person. Oh! Okay. Interesting. I really need to try out multiplayer. What is this new view? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> oh my god. He's just freaking stuck at the bottom. Oh. Poor guy. Oh, Skile. Hey, buddy. Oh, oh no, it's a sinker. <laughs> oh. How did he immediately get into here? What? <laughs> Look at this! This is the most I've ever seen a sinker duck freaking move! He's flying! <gasps> oh... How's it feel, buddy, to not be stuck at the bottom of the pool? Look at you move! This is a big moment. Look, Bobblehead. Even the heaviest duck in the whole game is floating around super freely while you're over here weighed down by your big head. Oh. oh! 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 Look at this! Is he being... What? Uh-oh! Hang on. Hang on. What is this up here? What is th What is this? Is he being mind controlled? Look at this. Oh, oh, oh. Is he going in? <gasps> what? Okay, this is exciting. Look at this. What is that? What? Come on, go into that light. It's gonna suck him under? Okay, just stay in here for a bit. Oh, look, it's got like a little waterfall over the door. I wonder what the frick this is about. <sighs> so many questions. Sorry, we'll be back. Oh, here we go. Another one. I want to be able to purposely choose this camera angle whenever I want. In fact, even better, I want to have a first person mode this so badly. Interesting. How do they get out? <gasps> oh, this looks beautiful. Just listen. <sighs> Will you go into the light, Dodo? Look at the tree. 
Oh, Bobblehead still has not made his way up. Head too heavy down there, bud. Hopefully he gets up here soon. Hopefully he can fit in the seat. <laughs> this is bizarre. Oh! Oh, look at this! What is... Oh, now that we've been in here, this is now a seat we can use. This is by far the best spot. Can we hear the music from in here? Oh, you can't even hear the music in here. Look at this freaking astronaut looking duck. Right, can we hit any button? What is this? Oh, 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 look at him. Oh, he's got a TV for a head. I assumed that was going to be a helmet. We've got a freaking robot duck. Oh, this is cool. Look at his face. Man, get back in there. I want to get this duck out. See, it says John in the tree. Maybe that's the user account. Let's go try that. <laughs> Hang on. <gasps> he makes TV static noises. John. Oops. Okay, no. It's not John. I want this guy out. He looks awesome. John. Who's John? Well, now this... <laughs> It's just sad. Also, where's- oh, hang on. Did you see that? What's this? Oh, it's moving! Hang on, I want to get on a duck in there. There we go. Okay, I wonder if it's like a timed thing. Where's it gonna drop them off? Look at them in there! Oh. They are being brainwashed. Hypnotized. What the frick, Albert? Oh, is it gonna put them in the machine where we could shoot them out? <gasps> oh. Oh, do not put them in space, though. Why does it say one down there? <gasps> what is this? Do you see that? A lot of cow like aesthetics. Is Moo Moo in there somewhere? What? What is this? Oh, now I'm curious if we're gonna see an alien spaceship come in with Moo Moo and maybe drop him in there for experimentation. Oh. What is this? This is fun. Look at this sinker duck just freaking going wild in here. <laughs> oh! Got airborne. Oh, he fell through! Oh no, he's gonna sink! Oh, uh, Well, oh, it is looking pretty gross in this water. <laughs> it's not very clear down there. Alright, well I assume he's never moving again. Oh, whoa, whoa! 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 What, what just happened? Did you break the tube? She's like stuck. <laughs> oh no. <sighs> ah. Weightlessness. So peaceful. Let's check the seating area again. Oh, this is the other seat. <gasps> oh, she made it up. <laughs> so they can get in here through the tube too. Okay. Okay, right, so I think we got all the seats. Seat one. Seat two, seat three, seat four, and seat five. Look at it in here. Yeah, look at the walls. I didn't realize how weird they looked. Oh! Quack. Glowy fell through. You guys get sucked back into the pool. We belong. <gasps> Have we seen nighttime yet? I guess there is no night in space. There's a sun or a moon. I didn't think about that. No day cycle. Which kind of makes me a little bit sad because I love the sun setting and the sun rising in the other pools. There's something extra cozy about nighttime in these games. But I guess in space it's always nighttime. Oh, he's making it out! Oh no. Oh, okay, yeah, the water just pushes him back in. Yeah, so I'm, I'm 
pretty sure the light in here is how they get out. Quack. Listen to it. It's a portal, guys. Someone take it. Maybe he's in that little ship that's orbiting outside. <gasps> I'm hearing it again. What does it mean? Oh! It like got dropped into the cow thing. Did it go out into space? What are you in? Oh, oh, hang on. Okay, we cannot select Moo Moo in there. Was there two ducks in there? I feel like I see another duck. Maybe there's two Moo Moo's in there. What are you doing, Albert? Oh, it has numbers on it. It says two now. Is there two cows in there? Maybe you need a certain amount of cows. So I think every time we hear the UFO coming, it's dropping off a cow. So next time we hear it, we'll have to go up there and look around. This is always such a cute scene. Here with little babies. Maybe you guys will get split up in this pool. When the duck enters the cave of relaxation. <gasps> oh! Oh, he went through the portal! I wish I was watching that, but we'll see it again, I'm sure. Either way, let's stay right here for a bit. Well, there's the freaking hippo! We're on the hippo! The name of the DLC makes so much sense now. Look at it, it's so cute! Look at its freaking ears! I did not think we are gonna actually be on a freaking hippo. Where's Beelzebub? Oh, he's in here now! Oh man, the portal just sends you into weird places. Oh. <laughs> okay, now we know how that works. What? Oh! Look at this guy! <laughs> that was a UFO duck. He's got six eyes. Oh, this is interesting. Is are Magma Ducks stuck up there now? Yes, he is. Look at him. Listen to him. Oh, that's cute. I wonder how we get this one in the pool, though. Oh, he's in the pool! Where'd you come from? Oh, he's flying! We got another duck that can lift out of the pool! <laughs> Speaking of, where the frick is Betty? I really want to see Betty in this pool. Oh, Big Head made it! He made it into the little ship. You know what that means? As soon as he's gonna be in the pinball arena. <sighs> What's that gonna look like? Oh! Oh, here we go! He's gonna drop a cow in! Okay. Didn't click on it. How many cows do we need for this weird experiment? Oh! Oh! <gasps> Whoa! Just took me off of him! Where did he go? Oh, okay, so it does just immediately teleport them into here. <sighs> Bubble Eye, your head would never fit in that helmet. Oh, this is cute. <laughs> what? Oh, we bugged something out. We can see the cows, though! And the number three. Get back on him. <laughs> Look at this. This is quite the scene. Oh man, he bugs this whole thing out when he's up here. Oh! Look at everything! <laughs> uh. 
Oh, look at those two float through space. Oh, we got four moomoos now, four cow ducks. I'm thinking five is gonna be the magic number. I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> I'm amazed we could see around his head in this camera angle. Uh... We're right side up, we're right side up. Yeah. No, 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 don't fall back over. Oh. <laughs> Even if I can't see more than half of the screen because his head is blocking it, that's fine. I'm loving this. We're heading to a tube now. Where will we end up? Who knows? We probably won't even know because we can't freaking see anything. <gasps> oh man. This is wild. <sighs> the Adventures of Bob. Oh, are we gonna do it? <gasps> oh! See you, Ringo. Oh, look at him. Oh, yes. 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 Let's float with Bob. Oh, man. This is kind of trippy. <laughs> this is a bit weird. Look at this. Oh. Ah. Uh. Ducks in space. Go ahead, Nugget. Come here often. Look at it. Look at the stars. This is cool. This is relaxing. <gasps> we got another Moo Moo coming. We might have to leave Bobo Vision. I think we'll stick in this for now. Oh, oh, oh. No, something did happen. Oh my god. <laughs> What? Okay, so I was right about five when you get five cows and they get turned into this. Oh, we got a new floaty in the pool. That can trap ducks. Oh no. Can this one be popped? This floaty is freaking adorable. Want to see the little one pop out in here? <laughs> Do it. Do the thing. <laughs> Look at this. There's so many of them. Rinko over here having the time of his frickin' life. Look at him go. Oh, how did two of you get in here? I was looking away for one second. How did this happen? Uh, no idea where Dodo came from. Oh, there's a name on the astronaut, Doug. G. Toto. Do you think that might be the username? Let's frickin' try it. G. Toto. Oh, there's this password. Shit. Hey look, Merlin Jr's in here now. He finally left the cave. Alright, I'm gonna look up how to get this password because I am very curious now. Alright, so it looks like we actually have to go to the Infinity Cool Pool to get the password. So let's go do that now. And then let's get in that door. 3229. Perfect. So the code, the password is on the domino piece on the table in here, I believe. Oh yeah, right here. Alright, so you're supposed to use the dominoes, get some numbers to put into the gray table, I think, in the relaxation cave. So I'm gonna take a picture of them here, and then we'll give that a try once we get back over there. Oh, look at this! The two sinker ducks are together! <laughs> I guess when they first spawn into this pool, they just immediately somehow get into this area. Interesting. We'll have to pay attention next time we restart the map. But for now, we wait. We need to get into that secret area again. <laughs> that was like instant. Oh, it's actually full! Look at this! Oh yeah, let's freaking go! all those ducks. So I guess confirmed, Magma Duck can light things on fire. Clearly. Oh, I don't actually know how this is supposed to work. Oh, maybe based on the way they're connected? I think so. Okay, so I think the first one will be two. We'll see. And then three. There we go! That's our password. Alright, back to the computer. 
Oh, let's blast this guy off. Will he hit it? Will he hit it? Yeah. Excellent. And then we get this stuck again. All right. Let's get back to that computer and put in our password. So ours is 850A. Oh. Then we're supposed to look for... Hang on. Let's turn off the music for a bit so I can think. All right. So it's run like DOS. Um, directory. There we go. Log sounds forsaken folder. CD forsaken folder. There we go. Okay. Uh, directory. Texture.db. So we gotta type in open texture.db. File is corrupted. Hmm. Wonder if now we can open it in here. No. Log. So cd log. Air log. Okay. And then open air log. Okay. We got our code. Though I'm not really sure what this code is for. So I'm not sure if that actually did anything. <laughs> the plot thickens. The mystery gets more mysterious. Oh, he just falls through the chair. Aw. You trying to fly in here, buddy? <laughs> He's just freaking sliding around in there. That's not safe. Strap in, dude. First things first, I wanted to get into this because I believe you can play the MIDI files. So you can go into sounds, and then you just type in the names and you can hear them. One dot MIDI. <laughs> Very alien y. Okay, I wonder if those mean something. Three. Interesting. Okay, they were not the sounds I was expecting. Marlene Jr. knows exactly where to hang out. Right in the waterfall. Oh, that's exactly where I would be too, boy. That is exactly where I would be too. Let's watch these crazy duckers. Oh no! I wonder if something happens if all of these get filled. If there's any point to this. Oh! Oh, it just it bounces them out. Okay. Oh, how the frick <laughs> did you end up over here, Ringo? You're screwed. There is no way you're getting out of this one. Oh, he's trying, though. He's trying. Listen to it out here. Do you hear that? That's the sound of space. Oh, good luck, Marlene Jr. <laughs> oh, so freaking close. Oh, look, the little ones in the spaceship. Circling planet hippo. Oh, look at the little hippo tail. Did you see that? <laughs> it's too cute. Wow, this metallic looking duck is looking extra shiny on this map. Look at how many lights are reflecting off of it. You look way better here. This light is doing wonders for you. Yeah, get out of here. I hope this one gets stuck to it. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! <laughs> That's better. No! No! Oh, damn it, we freed him. Freedom. Well, that's okay. Oh, Narwhal's kind of close. She needs her... Oh, and the bull. <sighs> oh, you might be getting popped soon, cow, if it is possible. You're surrounded. We need a frickin' Flamio Hotman or a Stumperman in here to help you guys out. <laughs> oh, Narwhal might not actually make it. I forgot. You get sucked up the... <gasps> What just happened there? Did Duck just land in it? What do you know? Why would you trap yourself like this? This kind of looks like what Darkel is made out of, doesn't it? Maybe the Darkel duck is an alien. Look at his little smile. Oh, he's so happy. It's a little bit creepy too, though. It's like a fake duck. <laughs> Can he even be popped? Maybe not. It might not be able to. Hmm. Hmm. 
What? I thought I saw him up there. What the hell? <laughs> Did you get a little bit too high, buddy? <laughs> what are you doing up here? Lost in space? He's a little bit green. Oh! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! <gasps> well, the cow is unpoppable confirmed. Damn. There's no way that that didn't pop him, if it was possible. Or maybe just Taurus can't do it. I didn't see Ramsey there. I thought Taurus just went freaking ham on that cow. It's not real, buddy. It's fake. Oh, look at him. He's got hearts. You like an elephant over there? <laughs> oh, here we go. Now this is a duck I want to be able to see from their point of view. As he dives into this nasty ass water. Look at all the crap floating around it. <laughs> oh man. Ringo, you're wild. He's trying to swim against it. He's trying to get out. He doesn't want to go down the lazy river, okay? <laughs> He's trying. He's trying. He's kind of succeeding. I guess as long as you're under the water, the current doesn't push you. He's gonna get out! <gasps> oh, Ringo! Did you make it? Oh, no, you're not getting out, bud. Just- oh! He faded out! <laughs> Amazing. Where will we go with this duck? Oh! Get in there! Get in there! Get in there! <laughs> oh, come on! Yes! 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 Oh, no, no, I didn't want to go in here, though. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, get ready. Maybe we'll get put into the cow thing. Oh, my God, this is a little bit dizzying. I feel like I'm on a fair ride. All right, Ringo, I'm ready to leave. This is making me dizzy. It's chaos. I'm not sure we're ever getting out of here. Oh! <gasps> oh, so close. Oh, Stargate's got out. I think Big Head did too. I don't see him in here anymore. And if he was up here, you'd know. You'd see his head no matter which direction you're looking. <laughs> go, go, go! Go, go! Go a little right! Yes! Good job, Ringo. You did good. We're free. Ooh, we might get into the zero G thing too. Oh no, it took me out of the vision! Wait! Oh, is it too long, I guess? That's too bad. Oh well. <laughs> Time to go look around at some other things. <laughs> What's going on here? You can do it, buddy. Don't be afraid. You can do this. Let's go down the slide. It's fun. Come on. Oh, there you go. There you go. Yeah. Well done. The door will open when you go find the code. Is that what the duck's back says? I never knew that. Is that who we just scanned? Hmm. Well, we've already done that now. <laughs> Thanks for the help. It is now the next day, and I've let this game going. Oh, where the? Oh. How the hell did he get out? Okay. <laughs> Whoa. I'm actually very excited in this pool because Benny can never leave. How fun will it be once we gather up a few hundred ducks and we just have multiple Bennies flying around everywhere? I am all for it. <laughs> I already have three! <laughs> I think I just saw two over there. Oh man, we've already got some Bennies in this pool. Perfect. Oh man, look at them all going through the tunnel. Dang. Oh man, this pool is already freaking amazing when you have so many ducks. Look at all <laughs> look at all the sinker ducks we have. I love that they get teleported into here automatically. Oh, that's funny. Oh, we've got more up here too. <laughs> oh, this pool a thousand times better when you have lots of ducks. Oh, come on, touch. There we go. He is now lit. Let's do the spark. Oh, what is a little stumper man baby? <laughs> Wow. 
I wonder if he needs to get somewhere specific before he can light off. Like, can he do it from in here and just fly through the glass? Like, how did it work? I'm thinking he cannot be lit off in this dome. <laughs> I think we have to wait for him to get out of here, which could be quite a while. Do we have another spark anywhere by any chance? I'm thinking no. Oh, there we go. Is it time? Is it time? Maybe. Maybe. Here we go! And he's off! Oh, he just explodes at the frickin' top! There they are. Okay, so he just explodes in the dome. <laughs> Makes sense. Okay, let's get to some duck naming. So I didn't want this video to be too duck naming heavy, so I'm just going to name the ducks that either A, somebody who's never named a duck before named one, I'm going to get those people in first, and then for the ducks who only got one name from somebody. And then any duck that had been named by numerous people, I think we'll just wait and do another video in a couple weeks and figure it out there. So our darling, darling cozy sweater duck did get a couple of names, but I'm going to go with Cozy Quaxy, named by TH Plays. They haven't named any ducks yet. This was the only one they wanted to name. So say hello to Cozy Quaxy, one of the cutest, coziest ducks we have in the whole pool. All right, let's find another duck who needs a name. Oh, our postage stamp duck also got a name, which is Shipment, named by Zora the side character. Oh, here's another duck that got a name that is very perfect. The Graffiti Duck, now named Banksy, named by the Egg of Ace. Oh, and then we've got the Baseball Duck here who also recently got a name. Fall Park, named by Paige Miller. I think I also saw, oh yes, our granite looking duck also got a name. Chard, named by that one person. Oh, and another one, they're all freaking right here, this is very convenient. Our beautiful ornament looking duck got a name. Wonderfully named Nick Quack, named by Sugar Pop. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> well, then we've got Ditto over here, who we are actually going to be renaming Copycat, named by Waluigi Bros. Ooh, here we go, another one. So a couple people did want to name the cat one, of course, but we're going to go with the first person who named it, who also has not named a duck yet. And so it gets the adorable name Skittles, named by Chromie after their late cat. Such a cute name. Our beautiful rainbow duck we're going to be naming Trevor, named by Moon the Vaporeon. Also for the Trevor Project. Oh, here's another one that got a name. The Skeleton Duck, who's now Sans, named by King DDD. Fantastic name. They also had the idea to name this one over here, but we're going to take the same name from Finn the Shark Guy, Poe. That way we can make sure we get a duck for you in this pool. See you. I'm curious where else this one's going to hide on this map, so we'll, we'll pay attention to her. Oh, look at this! The duck side of the pool. Look at that poster! <laughs> That's excellent. I like that. Thank you, Vanish, for making sure I saw that. I would actually put that up in my house. I love it. All right, back to naming. Oh, here's another duck that recently got a name. Our Nutcracker duck got quite an interesting one. These nuts, named by Valois Cressa Heller, a fantastic name. So I think actually the reindeer is the last Christmas duck that needs a name. The rest of them have been named now. All right, let's look around. Oh, look at this duck. He's happy up here. All right, so Zora the side character wanted to name that grid looking duck GLaDOS, which that duck actually got a few names now. <laughs> so we'll deal with that specific duck in the next video. Oh, look, freaking duckers in here too, sitting in the seat upright. Oh my God, that looks amazing. <laughs> it's a cute little crew we got going in here. Almost all named but this one. So I'm figuring we'll take the name GLaDOS and give this duck that name, right? It's almost too perfect. There we go. GLaDOS, named by Zora the side character. He likes it. She likes it. <laughs> All right. Who else do we still have to name? So this one also got a couple names, but only one person who hasn't named a duck yet. So they are going to be naming this duck Dark Matter, named by DD7. And I hope I got the right duck. So the person who named Deckerhug, photographer, changed their name. So we're actually going to be updating him also real quick. 
So Deckerhawk was named by Harper's VR, their new name. I'm curious what leads to this duck getting out of here. I don't think we've actually seen where he spawns from. Like, does he actually... I don't know, where does he come from? Oh, he just came out! Okay! He just came through the duck dispenser like all the other ones do. So I'm assuming he's just time-based. So many cute ducks. I love this little spaceship. <laughs> it's so cute. You may not even make it into the pool. Is it gonna be Taurus? I think so. I think so. Oh, here we go. This is it. Hasta la vista, flamingo. Wait. It's not working. How is that not stabbing it? Hmm. Taurus, I think you may have gotten cheated. What are you doing, ducks? Let it get in! They're all fighting back. <laughs> Look at this, they literally pushed it back up. You're not welcome in this pool, Flamingo. Stop it! Bad ducks! Let the Flamingo in. I'm starting to think it's never getting in the pool. <laughs> I've been here for over 30 minutes just waiting for this freaking Flamingo. Get in the pool! Oh. Squeakers! Good duck. It's game time. Oh damn, Ringo. You got some air on that one. Oh, she's already heading in. She's got her eyes on the prize. I might have to turn off names for this because it is getting <laughs> hard to see. Is this it? Is this it? Is this it? Is it going to be normal again? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Maybe. Maybe. What? The heck, Narwhal. Merlin Jr., get out of the way. Bad duck. Move. What? Narwhal? Really? Really? Disappointed in you. We are at uh, an hour and five minutes. <laughs> Our flamingo slayers are really slacking off today. <laughs> Smokey Bee just frickin' went in. This might be good. We might have another team kill if Smokey Bee can get this flamingo moving. Did another duck just enter the flamingo? What is going on here? <laughs> Alright, buddy, this is just getting ridiculous. Turn around. Turn around. Ugh! What? Come on. Can he just not stab it anymore? Could he ever? Have we seen Taurus stab it? Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm not sure if he ever has. Maybe not. I always thought he could. Well, I guess you're not a flamingo slayer. Demoted. They're all freaking just chilling down here. Is it your day off or something? What the hell? We need you guys up here to take care of this little problem. Unbelievable. This is a disaster. Well, someone- whoa. Did you see how fast Ringo just came at it? Are they all three still freaking down here? Well, there's Amori. There's Narwhal. And there's freaking Spartan! What the hell? <laughs> We're going on two hours, guys. And the Flamingo just took another victim. Look at all the ducks are on like, the other side of the pool afraid of it now. Summerman's up here trying his best all by himself with his little exploding robots, but it's just not enough. We need something sharp. No, no, no! Smokey Bee, don't do it! We don't need any more bees in this frickin' flamingo. That was close. <laughs> Lavinia's trying. Our little steamboat that could. Oh no, we're on the move! Oh no, no! Okay, we're good. You guys, that was your chance to escape! I don't think any ducks are coming to save you. Our bees got out! Yay! Squeakers though, I'm sorry. Oh! Narwhal's heading up and Spartan! And Amori! They're finally coming! They're finally gonna do this. It's about time. First Slayers entered the pool. Second Slayers entered the pool. 
And where's the third? There he is. All three of them are officially in the pool. I still cannot believe that Taurus could not pop it. Maybe they changed it. Maybe they made it so you can't kill the flamingo anymore. I hope not. Because if so, I've just wasted like two and a half hours of my life. You know what? Not wasted. Still enjoyed it. I'm still here with my ducks. Oh no. It looks like the bees are guarding it now. This is quite the freaking battle. Oh man, but Stumper Man, he's trying. He's sending in as many ducks as he can with his explosions. Yeah, he sent those bees away. Good job, Stumper Man. Whoa. Ringo? Damn. That, I think, was the best one. You've seen him get some serious air today. Right there's Spartan. He's slowly making his way over. Slowly. Very slowly. Come on, Spartan. Don't let the bee stop you. You can do this. You can do this. I think he's the only one close. Yeah, there's Narwhal over there. Oh, there he is right there. They're all coming in, all three of them. Who will it be? Who will it be? Oh, no, no. Bad narwhal. Bad duck. Narwhal, no. Don't go down that slide. <sighs> Alright, it's not gonna be narwhal. <laughs> We've lost her again. Spartan's heading towards the slide, too. As is Omori. Come on. Block the slide, Flamingo. Somebody do something. I need to have some sort of control, man. Oh my god. <laughs> They're both gonna get back down there. Damn it. Somebody please take out this flamingo. Save squeakers. Moore's kind of going for it. Which way will he go? Which way will he go? No, no, no. Make the right decision, dude. Well, Spartan's kind of going towards it now, too. I don't know, he's getting hes getting drawn in by the slide. I think we're gonna lose him. I'm giving a temptation, Spartan. You've got a job. Oh, how unfortunate. We've lost another one. <sighs> Alright, Amori. And then there was one. You got this. Oh, no, no! Stubber man! What have you done? Shh, dang it! Alright! <laughs> there were none! Ah... Uh, Thanks, Cozy Quacks, that helps. This is insane. Insane. Okay, around what, five, six, ten? I don't know, I've lost count. But, Amori's back. Knife in wing. Oh, yes, he says, help him out, Stumperman. No! Marlene Jr. He just pushed it away. Somebody turn him. He needs some assistance. Well, I mean, the Superman explosion did kind of push the flamingo towards Amori. <laughs> That's something. Turn. Turn. He's right behind you. This is good. The flamingo is getting positioned between Amori and the slide. This is very good. This could happen. Ooh, ooh. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, this is working out. This is working out. <gasps> Look at this. Don't let me down. I'm gonna be let down. I just know it. Oh, Bert, get out of the way! Move, Bert. Everybody move! <sighs> Thought that was it. It was not. Oh, Narwhal's back up here, though. Here we go. Stumperman, are you working with the flamingo right now? It's kind of feeling like it. Oh, they're like right freaking next to each other. They're both facing the wrong way. Oh, well, there's two narwhals now. Okay. Two narwhals, one Amori, and... Stumperman, I swear, you quit it. Oh, oh, oh! I almost didn't see it behind Big Head. <sighs> Come on! Oh, yes! It has finally happened. It took over two hours. But it is done. Narwhal, the reigning champ. I believe this is her third, if not fourth, slaying. Well done, Narwhal. You have free Squeakers and Mallard Duck. Oh, look, look at it. <laughs> That's what you get, Flamingo. Damn. I'm pretty sure that was the longest time I've ever seen you live in this pool. Impressive. But it's happened. I was starting to question if it could even still be popped anymore. 
Hang on, I'm gonna watch it from here. So earlier I was watching when the alien dropped off something and something pink and fleshy came out of the tube. <laughs> I wanna see if it like... Oh, hopefully we can see it from here. Well, there's the new cow. I did not see anything exit it though. All right, so since now I do believe it is confirmed that Taurus just could not pop the flamingo. I like how he just drops in. Very good timing, Taurus. I don't think he can actually pop the floaties. So I decided to come back, wait for a new cow floaty, and now we're gonna see if it can be stabbed because I am putting off the video just to figure this out, to find out. So let's get some tabs on any of our Slayer ducks. Hopefully there's one nearby, but I'm thinking no, I do not see any. Hopefully one drops in. I guess we can check the uh, pinball area. Oh, we do have a narwhal up here, so she may drop down and be the slayer. <gasps> oh, there she is! Is it could it be narwhal? Two times in one video? We shall see. If narwhal can't pop it, then nobody can. Guaranteed. Though if I'm being honest, I kind of am rooting for Omori to get it because I feel like... I'm not sure I've ever seen him. Oh, and he's right there too. Oh. It could be. It could be. This may not take as long as I thought it would. All I'm hoping for is it doesn't take over an hour to get this cow down like it did for the flamingo earlier. Oh, man, it might be. Oh. It's like it's meant to happen. They're both slowly inching towards each other. Oh, do be proud of Mori. Do be proud. Oh, no. They're going the wrong direction. Frick. Frick. Come on. Oh, he is. He is. Oh, he wants to. He knows what he must do. Oh. Eggbird helped out a little bit. No! No! We just lost freaking Narwhal too. She went up. You're letting me down again, dude. Are there any other ducks around who can do it? No, I don't think so. The nice thing about this pool though is anyone can drop in at any time. Oh no. Let's go check out the pinball area. Is there any other ducks in here who might drop down? There's a lot of Tauruses. Oh, Vanish, look at you up here. Oh, there's another hiding spot right next to the chair. That is cute. All right, better get back down quick before we miss the event, which still could happen. Oh, hang on. Hang on a second. I never stopped believing in you, Amori. Come on, just a few more inches. <gasps> He's going for it. He's going for it. He's going for it. <gasps> oh! Okay, it can be popped. I am glad we revisited it. So Taurus just can't do it. So for whatever reason, the bullhorns can't do it, but that's fine. So that means what we have four potential flamingo slayers. We've got Omori, who I think that was his first kill we've ever seen. And then we've got Spartan can definitely do it. And Narwhal. Is that it? I guess so. I guess there are only three. Whoa. Oh, the water turns to milk. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm glad that was confirmed. Impressive, Omori. That is freaking awesome. So it all will be turned to milk. Does our waterfall turn to milk too? Let's find out. Ah, maybe. It's hard to tell. It might be. <laughs> oh, he skittles. Oh, well, I am very glad we came back and did that. So, since we've now done that, let's look around a bit. We have like 250 ducks in this pool. Let's see what all the areas look like full of ducks before we go. And then I guess that'll be it. Look at all the freaking ducks we have in here. Oh, man. So, this is what Hippo Space Download Pool looks like with a full pool of ducks. It's crazy. Oh man, it's raiding ducks in this pool. Oh, the milk's gone, so it does disappear after a little while. That was cool. I wonder if now that it's been popped, if we can start collecting more cow ducks to get a new one, or if it just stops always at five. <laughs> Benny has reached weightlessness. I always knew he could. Is he stuck in the dome? <gasps> he might be stuck in the dome. 
<laughs> Where are you going, Benny? You can't escape this pool. You will never escape again. Look at all the bennies. Look at them all. If I wait long enough, I can get as many bennies as I want in this pool. And I will. I will. Oh, all right, that was the newest Placid Placid Duck Simulator DLC, Hippo Space. What did you think? Is it your new favorite pool? For me, I don't know. I think Quack in the Ice still might be my favorite, just barely, because I just love that fireplace. But I will admit, this new pool gets really exciting the more ducks you have. There are so many places for them to go and so much ridiculous things for them to do. I love that. There's always something to watch, but I'm always feeling like I'm missing something <laughs> if I'm sitting in one seat too long. It might be my new favorite. I don't know. I'd have to think about it for a bit. I guess the other question is, which of the new three ducks is your favorite? The astronaut duck, the UFO alien-y duck, or the TV duck? For me, I think... Let's find it. Let's see if we can find it. Oh, here it is. This one. Oh, he's still got the X's for eyes. No! Oh! Oh, she liked that. Did you see that? Trevor bumped her and she immediately was into it. <laughs> the most expressive duck, for sure. Yeah, at first it was the astronaut duck, because it was just so freaking adorable. Then it was the floating alien UFO duck. But now I think it's this one after watching it for a bit. All the different facial expressions it can have. I also saw it have the angry face a while back too, but I did not catch it in recording, unfortunately. I was just had the game playing while I was collecting the ducks and saw it. But yeah, this one, definitely my favorite out of the new three. It might even be one of my favorite ducks overall. I don't know. Uh, either way, I think we saw everything we needed to see in Hippo Space. And if not, we'll be back. We will explore it again for sure. Let me just finish this off by saying a huge thank you so much for watching these videos and for liking them and commenting and for naming ducks. You've made this game so enjoyable for me by doing that. And I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And I really hope you enjoyed. And if you did, give it a like. <laughs> I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.